Welcome everyone. Ahmed Shukri here, a Rajiv Bull Sales Engineer. Today's topic is one of the most biggest and exciting updates we have ever introduced. We are proud to announce a major upgrade, a game changer for ISPs and home Wi-Fi providers, Rage Cloud ISP. You might be asking what was the missing from the current Rage Cloud platform, and honestly, the answer is nothing. The core platform is still the same powerful engine we all trust, but Rage always aims for perfection and ease. That's why we have designed a brand new experience tailored specifically for ISPs. Even if your client doesn't have a cloud account, they can still manage basic tasks like changing their Wi-Fi name and password easily and securely. And this video isn't just about what the Rage Cloud ISP, it is about why. Why you will replace other home routers with Rage Re home router because Rage speaks to everyone from advanced networking engineers to everyday users with no technical background. Rage here to transform how networks are managed. Our surprise today will solve real world problems, reduce operational costs, minimize after sales technician needs, say goodbye to unnecessary side visits. Let's break it down step by step. Now, let's ask the most important question. Why Rage Cloud ISP? We have already a top-tier cloud platform praised by IT managers and networking engineers worldwide. So, why build something new? It is simple. Our partners started comparing Rage Re home Wi-Fi routers with other competitors in real-world deployments. They trust Rage our performance other. So, we listened carefully to their feedback, solved the key pain points, and built a dedicated ISP experience that offers something truly unmatched. Let me start by introducing some of our powerful re home Wi Fi devices. A wide range is available, and even more models are under development, each one designed to meet a specific customer's needs. After the market research, Rege always started where others stopped. We identified three major pain points affecting users around the world. First, poor Wi-Fi performance. Second, frequent devices failures during power surge or storms. Third, high operational costs for on-site support and repeated resets by end users. These issues affected reliability, cost, and customer satisfaction, and we were determined to fix them all. So, let's talk about what inside Rage Route and what makes them different from the competition. And let me introduce the first issue, which is Wi Fi performance. And to fix this issue, Rage added the FEM, F E M, which is the short for Front End Module. FEM is the heart of Wi-Fi performance. It includes PA, power amplifier, hostess transmission power, LNA, low noise amplifier, improved signal reception at weak points. This results in a stronger coverage, better wall penetration, and stable uplinks even at long distance. And one of our most loved features, the mesh setup in one click. No tech experience needed, no application, no confusion. Just press the mesh button on the main router and you are connected. The second issue was speed performance. And Rege solved this issue by upgrading the CPU architecture with faster, more powerful chipsets than what competitors offer. Third issue was voltage surge failure. We fixed it with an enterprise grade power adapter supporting 6 kilo voltage surge protection designed to withstand stormy conditions. 
This video demonstrates the 6 kV surge protection capabilities of the RGEW1300G router compared to a 1300M router from another brand without surge protection. Thunderstorms can cause voltage surges in the wires, potentially disrupting the operation of routers. All Ray G Array home routers feature enterprise-grade power adapters that provide 6 kV surge protection. To simulate a lightning strike scenario, a surge generator was used to produce a 6 kV voltage. Both routers operated normally before the test, and mobile phones connected to them without issues. During the simulated lightning strike, the RGEW1300G continued to function properly, while the 1300M router from another brand stopped working. The comparison shows that the 6 kV surge protection in Reiji Array home routers ensures a more stable experience. In some countries, power isn't always stable, and that causes thousands of home routers to get damaged every year. To protect our devices in such tough environments, we have added voltage regulation directly into the adapter. This feature keeps the router stable even when the power is fluctuating or running low, preventing crashes and extending the device's lifespan. Now, and related to the software, let's explore some of Rege exclusive features that truly make a difference in home router series. We can start with NAT Traversa, and our partners, they already have named it as the Magic Stick. You will find a link to a dedicated video in the video description. Now with the big moment, we are officially introducing the Regia Cloud ISP. Let me walk you through this from the real life scenario of an ISP engineer. Imagine you are selling a home router in your ISP shop. You have already collected the customer's name, phone number, email, and address. And now, even before the customer opened the box, we simply take the serial number of the sticker. That's all you need. The model and the MAC address will be automatically detected once you add the device to the RayJ Cloud ISP. Once we log into the standard RayJ Cloud homepage, you will find the EW Series Router under the Home Router section. Here, you can configure the device but you are limited. There is no patch control or ISP-focused features. So I now switch to Rage Cloud ISP. This is a real hands-on walkthrough. I'll copy the information from the customer and the router's serial number from here. The first thing an ISP engineer needs to do is create the project for the new router, along with all the client info collected from the contract. Click Add in the top left corner, then press on Add Project. You can either enter projects one by one or import multiple projects via Excel. It's super easy. Import, download the template, Fill in your client's information and router serial number, even before unbook and upload it path. For this demo, we will add a project manually. Refer to the node where you wrote your client's data and start copying it in. Project name, EW3000GX-PRO. Project group, choose your account, management password, set your admin password. For the location, enter the customer's address. And thanks to Google Maps integration, you can easily pinpoint their home. Now scroll down, click on Advanced. Enter the customer's name, email, and phone number. Press OK. Now comes the amazing part. Pre-configuration before delivery. Choose device type, home router. In step 2, you will enter the device details using the serial number from the box. Press OK. 
Now, and while your client still at the shop, ask the customer what Wi-Fi name, SSID, and password would you like? Open the configuration section, add the Wi-Fi name, the SSID, and add your password. Press OK. Now, just tell your client, go home, connect the router to the internet, and call us if needed. Once the router is online, you might receive the call. Hi, I wanted to change my Wi-Fi name and password again, but I don't want to create a cloud account. And let me tell you, that's absolutely fine. Regi Cloud ISP lets us help such users easily. Here is what you do. Go to Permissions, click Share Project with End User. To the role Wi-Fi owner. Select the client's project. Set the validity of sharing time. In this case, choose permanently. Add a remark as a reminder, such as the customer's name. Press OK. Finally, copy the generated link and send it directly to the client by message. That's it. Simple, secure, and ready to use. Let's now look from the end user perspective. They receive the link and open it on an incognito tab. No cloud login needed. Paste the link. Prompted to set a password for security. Now I close this tab to paste the link again. To we'll ask for the password. The user can only see and change the Wi-Fi name and password, nothing else. Simple, secure, and hassle-free. Now, what we need to do is to create a template. This is specifically useful if the ISP wants to apply a specific setup across all routers in one click. We call it patch configuration. For example, some ISPs prefer to set a default SSID with their brand name on all routers they provide. So, how we can configure this setup easily and efficiently? Let's explore it together. This is batch configuration using templates. Let's say you want all your routers to have an SSID, like Regiary is my favorite. Click on Add Template, choose Home Wi-Fi Support, under Wireless, select Wi-Fi Template, Template Name. Now you have two options. Either add a new SSID alongside the existing one, or simply override the current SSID. And I'll also set the same Wi-Fi name for all projects. From here, just continue with the normal steps, Wi-Fi Name. Enable encryption if needed. Password. Optionally, generate unique eight digits passwords for each project, or just keep it simple and use the same password for all projects. It's totally up to you. Scroll down and click Advanced, Wireless Mode, VLAN, Hidden Network, Client Isolation for more security, 5 GHz priority, quality of service, and speed limitation for a single client or for all Wi-Fi users. Press save. Now we will add it as a task. The task name will be add Wi-Fi ISP. The template, Wi-Fi ISP. Set the validity period. Devices that connect within this time window will automatically receive the configuration. Press next. Choose target projects. And remember, you can choose all of them in just one click. Press save. You will now see the task running. Once applied, you will see the new SSID name in your Wi-Fi list. Here it is. Regi is my favorite. And to double check, you can always go back to your project page. Configuration. Regi is my favorite. 
let me share with you a little trick and to be honest i think many of you will relate whenever i find the internet is not stable at home i do what most people do i run straight to the router and press that lovely reset button of course everything gets wiped out all the configuration are gone then i call the isp with a big smile hello ya habibi please help me and guess what the isp replies you reset your router sir okay let's start from scratch time wasted for me and for them too so why not avoid all this headache together let's stop our customers from resetting their routers and losing everything instead we will keep the configuration safely safe and easy to reapply now i'll show you how to do this using batch configuration with a powerful template you will love this one let's go after a reset everything is gone and the isp has to reconfigure everything again to stop that cycle let's use patch config to disable factory reset patch config a template home wi-fi support in your template to the disable reset option clarification about this point if connected to reg cloud a factory reset will not delete settings if disconnected the router will retain one and wi-fi settings other configs will reset apply this template in the same way and you have saved hours of support time. Almost done. Let me show you a few more powerful tools. From the dashboard, if a project location in the dashboard is incorrect, go to project, click on the three dots, edit, move the bin on the map, press OK. Again, from the dashboard, we start with a centralized monitoring view. The dashboard on Regia Cloud ISP is essential for real-time monitoring across thousands of projects. On this user interface, at the top you will see the total number of projects and the total number of devices. And here we have one traffic usage. In the middle, you will find the map as we introduced earlier. On the right side, you can easily track alarms and the top projects with highest usage. In the project section, we also have a card view, which allows you to quickly monitor up to 100 projects at once. Now open the project, you will find full visibility. You can get customer information from this owner information. You can reset your device from three dots and the brace on the factory default. And in the overview side, we can reboot the device. We can open the eWeb of the device. We will talk about this amazing model of home routers in a separate video. We can ping to check the connection. Configuration including Wi-Fi configuration, project password, radio settings to allow you to change some factors like radio frequency. And also we have the option to set schedule for our SSID to be active or not. And finally, disable reset and don't miss health monitoring. Showing you weak signal clients, online clients, 2.4 and 5 gigahertz status. Plus we have network tools. Pen, trace route, DNS lookup, HTTP test, all built in for your diagnostics. And finally, we have alarms. Really, thank you for watching all the way to the end. I hope everything was clear and helpful. As always, I am here to support you and see you in the next video.